all right welcome back back in the shed again today is a quick look we had another bargain from B&M this is a special pie it said it was six pound well actually it wasn't six pound is that what is that recording this was two pound fifty it was on the bargain shelves you get now and then and I thought do you know what it'll be alright for the garden or something so I bought it let's have a look shall we I suppose the thing is with with B and M, it's like home baggage. You know, if it's a local deal, what happened? Stop! <laughs> well, my battery went, so you probably noticed the cuts. I have to get some decent batteries for sure. So let's see what our two pound fifty radio looks like. It's got. The instructions there. I don't know if you can see that there. If you want, you can pause it. You can see that there. Pause it. Okay. Quick rundown. It's an in, in tempo FM radio uh, instruction manual. Blah 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 blah. Okay. It's got a shit ton of low uh, modes here. It's more like a book. Okay, I think I'm going to read that when I need to. So if I put that there, let's have a look. Nicely boxed, really, for the cheap old radio. I just thought it was a handy size to have. And it's got its own little aerial. Radio, volume, up, down mode. Place for batteries. It takes two AAA batteries. I've got some here. Pound shop. You got about 600 for a quid. If you can open my One. I thought I should have done this beforehand. But preparations. A king. Prepare to fail or fail to prepare. Something like that. So flat on the spring. It's back on here. There is no inputs on it at all. It is basically what it is, is a radio. There's no directional on the radio, which would have been handy, I suppose. Light as anything. It's got date Friday and then month, month. You can say what if you go over mode, alarm. It's got an alarm clock on it. Radio. Sleep. Temperature, you got. Shall we have a look at the big uh, instructions? Quick. Quick look. I don't want to set the alarm for now. Radio boot time mode. This radio can be set to switch a particular radio mode on at a designated time, which is handy, I suppose. Okay, set the radio time. I'll. Put that like that so you can look at that. You can pause it if you want. I'm not going to read all that. Using the FM radio basic functionality, this radio will turn on automatically when battery is inserted. The radio home screen continuously displays the time, the date, the day, the temperature reading by fault. The temperature reading can be changed to degrees centigrade or degrees Fahrenheit by pressing down from the LCD button. Down. All right, yeah, seventy. That's it. Okay, so how do you go? How do you scan? Uh, do do do. Step one: turn the radio on by press and hold radio. Then it beeps. Ah! Oh. Once the radio is in FM mode, use the up down to automatically scan for radio stations. So. That's all right, yeah. La, 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 la. I'll talk over this just in case some lunatic wants to give me a copyright. That's quite good, isn't it? Let's scan again. Do you know what? It's got a silent scan, but for a little radio, and I'm in the shed, it's picking things up really good. Got a volume 
number on it so you know what you're doing. Let's turn it on to no. Right, I've done that. For £2.50, if you want a, ra a radio for your shed, check out your local B&M. It might well be there. Um, I don't want to leave that music play. I'll just turn the radio off. I suppose you hold it. Yeah, you turn it off by holding the radio button. So that's another quick video for that. It takes two AAA batteries. And you can stick it on your shelf and forget about it. You set your station you want. So if I hold down radio. And you scan it. Up. The volume. It doesn't show you the uh, frequency until it actually hits the frequency. So there we have it. An in-tempo, cheapo radio. Ideal for the shed. Size of it will fit on anyone's shelf. Go like that. I don't know if you can see that. Fit, fit, fit anywhere. Put it like that. It's got two AAA batteries. Probably last a year. Not fantastic speaker sound, obviously, but enough for what I want it for. So now I can be pottering in the shed with a half decent, well, I won't say half decent, but it's got, it picks up a good signal. That's what matters. It doesn't fade out. And that's it. Another B&M bargain, £2.50. Go and get one for yourself. Till the next time, take care. Bye-bye.